So this is the story about a bicycle I had that got stolen and turned up a year later. So I was living in the small country town north of Stockholm, Sweden, and uh, I uh, I used this bicycle a lot to get around. And um, this was, I think it was around autumn-ish and my um, I remember I lived in this really cool place a blue house with three uh, apartments so I kind of had to walk downstairs and where I went like it was just like a one bedroom and I couldn't go out and they had a sauna there in the back as well it was really cool and there was a neighbor upstairs with kids and my, that was my brother's friend and she was so lovely her whole family and then at the very up uh, at the very top there was a the owner that lived there and yeah but anyway so i lent this bicycle out to my cousin and she went like for the i don't know for the night she was going to do something with her friends and uh, she said that she 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 half locked it and she just left it. She was going to order something to eat, like a chips or something like that. And all of a sudden, it just disappeared. It was so weird. And uh, there was quite a few people around, I guess, and no one saw anything. So uh, she was devastated. And I was like, oh, don't worry about it. I kind of needed it. But <laughs> it, it was okay uh, because winter was coming anyway. So I'm like like 8 months later I think this was around spring I moved to a new place um totally new place the other so- side of town and one day when I walked out on the balcony I see my bicycle laying there in the ditch just outside and I also remember that the snow and the ice were just disappearing so in Scandinavia, like it's such a beautiful feeling when spring comes, when the snow disappears and the ice is almost gone as well. So I just remember that and I could see the, um, the grass there. And there was my bike. And I was like, oh my God, I can't believe this. So I walked downstairs and the bicycle was there and it was totally intact. It had no rust or anything. It looked like it was untouched. And uh, it had the lock that my cousin said it was kind of half locked. And luckily she gave the key back to me so I could just unlock it. I just pumped up the tires and I could ride my bicycle. I still think about this, who it was. Like, honestly, that person must know, have known who I was and maybe that was skilled or something. I don't know. But anyway, I got it back. And that's the that story. (laughs) 